I, I could grow full head of hair. I just shave you could. Off. You just prefer to be a bald guy. Uh, yeah, no. I'll tell you a very quick story that surmises it. My father's still in America. He came over to visit. My mom said to me a couple days before he comes, your dad's coming. We're going to go get a haircut. Cut my hair. My dad turns up. He's only there for a couple hours. I haven't seen him in nearly six months. And my mom said, I hate the way they cut his hair. And I said, yeah, they cut my hair wrong today. And my dad lost his temper. I said, what the fuck? The fucking men. Who cares about their hair? Your haircut doesn't matter. And my mom's like, well, no, Emery. It's just she cut it wrong. Da, da, da. So I'd only seen my dad for three hours at this point. Fucking six months. They got a big argument. My mom kicked him out of the house. The next day he called me. He goes, I can't come to the house. Your mom doesn't want me there. Come to me. And I came to him and we went to the hairdresser. He goes, come with me, boy. He goes, you learn when you're older. You're going to understand when you're older. You're going to shave your head. When I went home, my mom went fucking crazy. But when I shaved my head, my dad said, listen, you're going to grow into a man and you're going to learn that there's so many things that society expects of you and there's so many things that people expect of you. And the last thing on the list is going to be your haircut, right? So I had hair until about three, four years ago. And I was remembering this story. So I was sitting in a hairdresser and the guy in front of me, he goes, oh, finish. And he goes, oh, excuse me. Can you just a little bit here and top and here and here? And I'm sitting there and I'm just on my phone. And I'm like, who gives a fuck? So when it was my turn, I sat, he goes, hey, how do you want your haircut? And I remember the story and I just couldn't, I said, like, bro, shape off. Who gives a fuck about my hair?